you are supposed to be guarded, you are supposed to be private, this is supposed to be private, it is, and then no one has access to it. I'm not lying, guys. I'm going up for YouTube, man. I'm trying to edit it. Ah, uh, that's his thing. Alright, we're trying to do the current live. Good damn it. No, we, have, we have to go through with this, you know? <laughs> we have to go through with it. I want to play as John. Tell me how many objectives reuse is allowed. Yes, because I need permission before you can reuse it. I mean, you need permission from me to be able to use this content. <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't care as such. I just, as long as you let me know, if you let me know, I'll most likely say yes. But if you go ahead and do it anyway, and I find out, I am, and then you ask me after, I'm probably going to say no. Oh my god, he's fears. Morning, Arthur. What, 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 where's my, where's my tent? Where? Where's my tent? I don't know where my tent is. Oh, that's a horse. She overlooked it as a donation. That is a donation grab for the butcher. Supplies. I'm pretty sure this is my. Oh wait, hold up. Come on, I'm so hungry. Please don't hurt me. Such a tent. Okay, I think I know how. I think I know how I'm gonna do this. I look for my tent. That's how I do it. Ah. There you go. Oh my gosh, your beard's growing. Yeah, oh. I can't go anywhere. Maybe I will do that long. That's it. Yes. Okay. Wait. Uh, hold on, my bed still looks. Oh, there we go. That's actually slight. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, no, so, yeah, no, okay, so this is my place, you know. Let's check the ammunition. The ammunition is a problem. Can I change out the, like, clothing? Sleep, inspect. Oh. Yeah, clothing, outfits. Are they gunslinger? I should not know. I feel like this. At least, uh, change the hat. When are we? 
actually eating, Pearson. Yeah, well, I thought I'd be joking. This. Okay, suspenders. Do we, we have to have them on? Anyway. Oh. Don't want to swim down there. Boots, here we go. Such a Good morning, Arthur. I told you that Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. 
Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. If you're gonna take the old man into town, you can take us too? Why, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. OK, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Lumbago. It's very serious. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really. You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? I'd really appreciate the help. I I'm worried this one here will bolt on me, too, if I leave him. Sure, no problem. It's the white one over there. Easy there, now. easy. Whoa, now, easy. Easy there. Step. A gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. Come on, let's go. To Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did it. <laughs> <laughs> back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Go left here, down the main street. Chair's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> 
Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. What's the meaning of this? All right. Here we are, just like I said. The cultural center of Sip. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. <laughs> Morning. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Plenty out on the shelves, but I got more out back. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. <laughs> okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. Here's to your good health, my sir. <laughs> it's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace train full of rich tourists heading to San Diné and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out in there New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? Seemed easy. They haven't gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. Get your hands off of her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey, hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go wait with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her! 
I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. This place just wears you down. Can I help you, sir? Can help people. I, I do all I can manage. Are you doing all you can? Huh? You looking for a room, sir? Use your strength to help the what? weak. A bath, perhaps? No trouble now, please! Oh, get the hell out of here, will you? Sorry. My bad. Long room. friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here! Waste of my time. What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank. Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh. me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey. Who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. On, Listen, please. buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. Don't come on, I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Just on it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. You stop right here. Why me? Get off my back, damn it, Mr. Please. I'm sorry. That's far enough. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me out. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. Please. My hands are slipping. <clears throat> All right, come on. Push my finger. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Give me Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see... I was in Blackwater. I kill people. And 
Maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one sense in this year old mind. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. I mean, I told him everything. I should do the side missions. Hey, my horse! Am I glad to see you? Drink up, ladies. <laughs> hey, all right, there we go. Oh, Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just a toughest teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell <laughs> this one is a pussy cat. Exactly, yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey! hey there he is! Watch where you're going! Take it easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him?
joke, Tommy. I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir. But please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very oh, same. Well, well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. Oh, but that's Charles. And Bill looking as well as can be. Oh my god, I didn't even Gentlemen. notice that it's Charles. Always that stuff again. a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And hey, young Sean, too. it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater. But there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, ah, well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. What about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. Lord above!
It's me. Look who's back. Don't get too comfortable now. I won't. Well, that's why you can. We got work to do soon. Sure, Morgan. Well, that's not part of the story. My arms is gonna fall off. Speak! Don't cry, boy. Speak about your gang. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I, I told you, mister. I told all he is. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horse shit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you, no offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. Ain't no O'Driscoll. Are you sure as shit was? John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You gonna know, pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, up. I'll, I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right. I'll leave. Oh, so that's the one to do. Passing you. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might. I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me, instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey, hey, if I got my bearings, 
It's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. How are you holding up, John? Fine. Still ain't right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed rest. Hey, all right. Abigail wouldn't let me up. You know her. She won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a failure of reason, hiding behind your woman, we were getting shot at. And I'd do the same for you, if you was in a bad way. I hope so. But I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, O'Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what he does to his enemies. I got an inkling of what you all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. Bill, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. Keep that in your mind, young feller. Right at the forefront of it. Now we go left. The uh, road will take us up and round. Watch out! Sorry it wouldn't kill you. Those are the hills. Head for them. Save your horses. We gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this game. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourselves. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. Free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on him. Now. Who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting, here and now. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet, taking them out as we find them, trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. <laughs> I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. Just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Whoa! Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you. Every moment. I ain't gonna stop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Come on. Oh. 
Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you, strangers? Yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. And hey, over there, someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. You want me to take him? No. Just stay here. Don't you damn move. The next two. What's the plan? Let's get close to these two. Make no mistakes here. That's what the knife's for. When we're there, we move at the same time. Come on, you're looking to die to the... Good work. Moving on the camp. I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lady. He better be. Feller on the log. What are we doing about him? Take him quiet, Marston. Okay. Get your hands dirty for a change. Jesus. Okay. Now what? We're at the perimeter. What's the call? Time to move on him. You ready? Is up. Clever me. Let's go. How you doing up? said Combs be in the cabin. I'll check. 
You look out here. Give me some of that iron. You all right? Sure. Thank you. What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. <laughs> All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. Get lost. Oh, shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> Right you are. At least you got something tucked away.
Are you kidding? So everybody's just going there. I'm just gonna sit up here. Yeah. I'm not reporting. a million, Arthur. You're keeping busy? Trying to. Well, don't let me stop you. All right, then. Jose? You want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big Shire horse for a while now. Unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel, if I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, 
Don't be rude about this magnificent creature. All right, boy. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine Stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> Uh, I'll miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. You're all right, boy. Stables are just up ahead. Yo. Hi. All right. Go sell that big brute and buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. Hey. How can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. Why you have one vista? I saw you in my recommended. What about this one here? <laughs> you saw in your recommended? Yeah, That's you actually quite sell? a change, to be Let honest. Show you. Recommended. I don't know. You got papers? No. Not famous. No papers. Like... Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. <laughs> but your luck's in. I don't know why I was going to recommend it. Who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while? He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. I want to help small stammers. Really? Hell. You have been playing for one hour. Hour really? Oh, let me check. Okay, let me check real quick. I have. Oh, I have. I didn't even realize. That's my. That's my bad. I didn't even realize that. I have to buy a new horse. Oh, what I just. What should I name the horse? What should I, what should I name the horse? <laughs> Um, let me just search up horse names, because I have no idea what to name it. Can you play God of War? Can I play God of War? Um, Ragnarok or the original? Because I, I've got the original, but I don't have Ragnarok. It's not, and, uh, the old one, like, the God of War one wasn't. 
No, it's not downloaded. I haven't downloaded it, so. My brother finished the whole game. It's a big game, to be honest. It's a big game. Like, from what I've heard anyway, it's quite a big game. I remember um, seeing, like, not seeing people play, but it's just, like, seeing people constantly play, like, every single day for... Who knows In two months. months. In two months. It is a big game, to be honest. <laughs> it is a real big game. Yeah, that's good. Oh, I can't afford it. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll just leave out it. Do you play Fortnite too? Um, personally, I'm not a Fortnite fan. Face I, blue smiling. Um, I play Call of Duty. I play. Oh, no, what do I play? I play COD. I play GTA. I play. Um. I don't even know, man. Like, I, I don't play too many games, I just don't, don't play that many games. Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Or the Warzone cuss I have Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Um I have Black Ops 3, but it's not downloaded either. <laughs> but I have played Black Ops 3. I have Black Ops 3, Modern Warfare 1 Remastered, Modern Warfare 2 Remastered, Modern Warfare 2 19, Modern Warfare 2, like 2022, um, Warzone, Black Ops Cold War, Vanguard, even though Vanguard was actually kind of bad. Um, <laughs> and then, yeah, I've got quite a bit, and I probably shouldn't, but I do. Hey, partner, you got yourself a deal and a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Right, let's see. What is the time for you right now? 9.30. Oh, to be exact, is uh, 9.25 at night. And on me, a new grooming brush and some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. All right, you. Yeah. You treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Uh, not bad, Arthur. You happy? Well, I guess we'll see. Well, what happened to the horse I just brought? It's 1.25 p.m. for me. My Timezen is GMT plus three. Hop on up there. Let's go. All right, let's get going. You got quite a ride ahead of my, us. Okay, you know where's the horse that I just had? Where did that what's go? This lake we're heading for? Or is this it? No, I don't Look know. Out. It. It's called O'Cray's Run. I didn't sell it. Up the in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains. I sure didn't figure on that. Yeah, 125. But this time we're doing the chasing. In the afternoon. So things with you and John. Ain't it about time you I will subscribe. Thank you. I should actually stream more often, to be honest. But yeah, thank, thank you for subscribing. I've been trying to do as much Red Dead Redemption as possible. Um, even online, obviously, I'm trying to do some online. Yeah, no, thank you very much.
Oh. Actually, hey, what happened to the kid? Uh, okay. There was this kid that um, right up here. said to like, you know, he asked if we could. How many like, years have you been playing RDR? Do you know what's funny? I only brought it like yes. two weeks ago. Or like, well, not two weeks. I'd say last week. Well, I brought it last week, but I've always wanted to. Like, I was always kind of interested, somewhat, of just looking at the trailers or something like that. But I just could never have been bothered to buy it. And now I, and now I bought it, and now I'm playing it. So. We made it. Let's yeah. move around the other side. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains. See about Sean. Is the game good? Uh, so yes, Trelawney it's good. Says, it's good. I, I've been Bobby here and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. It's a really good game, so right, to be honest. It's really good. I, I, honestly, when I finish it, of course. I'm probably going to play the story again. This is a, like once Ooh, playthrough. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. One of my other friends had also brought this game and they start doing anything. Be right back, I have to something. Oh, yeah. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Let's go, girl. Whoa, back. Good job. Yeah. All right. Getting late. Wreck. We should camp here. Sure. Well, then you get a set up. Well, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. <clears throat> Morning, Arthur. <clears throat> you ready? Well, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. <sighs> so... What's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track them, but we might need to lay bait to draw them out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas 
bait than shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I in back? Yes, see you back. Berries. I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Oh, there it is. Okay. How you getting on with that bait? Okay. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. What's the hold up here? I have to go. When will you stream again? Um. Okay. Let's go. Probably this time tomorrow. Say this time tomorrow is when I stream. I don't know. It's very. It's hard to figure out. The last time streaming is today. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's yeah, I'm not going to stream it again till okay. tomorrow. How's that horse after the stream is. So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? Oh, I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the life? Yeah, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess okay, good luck in the YouTube Cara El Boca. <laughs> I drifted Thank back you. into it. I'm trying to make it to a thousand. She understood. She knew what I was. Yeah, I but remember you not being so around straight. for a while. Try. Oh, things were you looser try. back then. Truth and is, also just have fun. There's never really honest. any getting out. Staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You can do it if you want to really do it. No, Thank you. Not. Listen, Thank you for that. If Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have Appreciate a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. In giving out positive energy, so sire. See ya. Stay home, face blue star rise. Look for tracks, dumb <laughs> bones, any sign of him. Appreciate it. Him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. The tracks go into those trees. Eaten fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Something else on the ground, just here. Air shit here. Watch your step. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's gotta be close. Let's keep going. Damn it. Looks 
looks like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work. Which do you think? Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Thousand pounds, you say? More or less. Big scar down his oh, no. face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. You only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Give me a hand here. Got your knife? Shit. Easy. Now it's too close. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. <clears throat> nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. That's good. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that Didn't monster? Miss. Well, you coming? I'm gonna stick around <laughs> here for a while. It's <laughs> beast. <laughs> I'll see you back at camp. Yeah! Hi. Hi. Yeah.
like something. Looks a way off. All right, girl. Let's go, girl. You out, weren't you?
Scared about. Huh? Don't be. You'll be fine. You okay? Sure. Why are you walking around so sad? I'm not sad. You know these bored. hides and furs can also be You're done bored. up into coats and boots and bored such. Good. Beyond my skills, bored means you ain't scared. Around these parts grateful for being color. bored, lady. Soon enough they're gonna he be can scared. Make just about anything. You should drop in on us.
me righty come on now Pearson okay I'll keep my eye out for him doing it yeah uh, no, at all good job Arthur Take what I can get. Yeah, so I was Thank you, I was this. I was this. I was the best guy.
Don't start Play's no more crap what it here. used to be. The place ain't. How you doing, friend? Uh, hello there, sir. Don't think I've seen you around here before. Wouldn't kill I'm always afraid all them redskins. All right. For this, what can I do I for you? you? I wouldn't watch my family freeze to death in the winter of '72. If I'd known, known about him, you wretches. Shit's whole damn lot of you. You're worth one tree, uh, one buffalo, one redskin. I shot 19 of them once. Well, buffalo, no redskins. Don't know how many That's redskins pretty you decent. Killed, But they deserved it. They weren't Christians, so I sent them to hell. You should have thanked me. All you fools should thank me. Ain't no wild west no more around here. Ain't nothing. Nothing nice. It's more... Goddamn America. More goddamn shots. More goddamn prissy women in men's clothing and women in women's clothing thinking they must be men. My old Bessie, she could skin a bear with her teeth, so help me God. Look at you. Y'all you make a fella sick. I'm tired of looking at you, Quentin, you little shit. Not now, John, please. Put my boot. Give me the next. 